So, Captain, you've created some recipes, built out some workouts, and now you're ready to create a plan for the week. Isn't this exciting? First, I would like to mention that you can adjust your starting day for the week at the settings terminal. By default, it is set to Sunday to match your calendar. However, if you tend to do your grocery shopping on Thursday, for example, you may find it convenient to set your start date for the week to Friday. Once you have selected your desired start day, let's head over to the planning terminal behind me. Navigate to the week you wish to plan using the arrows in the top left, and we can get started. For the sake of this example, I am only going to be tracking calories for my diet. We can begin by deciding what we want to do for our breakfast for the week. I'll go ahead and select a bowl of cereal. We can see our calories have increased based on the recipe contents, and our grocery list and spare ingredients have also been populated. I notice that I have leftover milk for my cereal, and I know that my recipe for a peanut butter protein shake also calls for milk. I'll add it for day two. We can see it calls for half of a banana, meaning I'll probably want to have an even number of protein smoothies in my week. I can fill in the remaining days with cereal. I know I will be busy at lunchtime, and so rather than cook, I can select from a list of pre-made salads and soups to create different pairings each day. Depending on what I've selected, my grocery list will tell me exactly what I'll need to buy. For dinner, let's go ahead and make some salmon. Knowing that salmon is best fresh, we'll put a couple of them earlier in the week. We can see that this calls for a side of broccolini and so we can use the rest of our broccolini by adding in a few instances of our chicken dinner recipe. For the remaining three days, let's go ahead and make a batch of chili. We can see that our chili recipe makes extra servings, and we have not yet reached our calorie goal, so I can distribute a couple of them earlier in the week. The remaining chili servings might be shared with friends and family, frozen for later, or used in the following week. Finally, as a reward for sticking to my diet goal, I will add in a few bits of dessert for myself on the weekend. This brings us comfortably close to our calorie goal. Next, let's switch over to the fitness tab. I have two muscle goals. One to walk for 10,000 steps a day, and another to perform one full body workout at some point in my week. I know I will be too busy to walk on Thursday, so I will have to find another day that I can double up in order to reach my goal. For my workout, I know I added an extra bit of calories on Tuesday and Wednesday from my chili recipe, so I know to plan my workout for Wednesday to ensure optimal performance. And there you have it, Captain. A full week planned with meticulous.